Hi there, this is Tim Verdao from timverdao.com and welcome to my Animaze review. Um, today I'm going to show you what Animaze is, what you can do with it. Um, I'm going to show you the upsells in the funnel, also got some nice bonuses for you. So let's just dive into it and let me show you what Animaze is. Now first let me explain you what Animaze is. Uh, it is a software program that you install on your computer where you can create 3D animation figures that are going to do exactly what you're going to tell them to do. And also you can take a real existing photos and make characters from those photos. So right now I'm logged in. Um, as you can see here, this is when you open the application on your computer, you first install it. It's for Windows and for Mac and you give it a project uh, title name. So this is my uh, review project. Um, you can create this project or you can load an existing project that you saved before. So let's just simply create a project. And animes exist out of two parts. The first part is where you can create your own characters. And the second part is where you're going to build scenes uh, where you let the character speak. So first we start with this part where you can choose to create a male or a female character. Uh, so in this case, I'm a mill, so you can click on mill and then you can choose from three different options, thin, muscular or fat. So let's take the muscular and then here you can change um, all different kinds of things. So here we got the skin color, you can change the skin color to wherever you want. So this part is to, to modify this image in here. Also, you can choose the colors from here. Um, and then this is the red one. It's not really, really good one. So let's take this, this brown one, for example, or take lighter skin like this. And then you can also change, uh, select hair colors here at the bottom. You can change the hair colors. You can change uh, the eye color. So you could give them very blue eyes, as you could see. So this is just to, to modify the things. So there are many sliders in here where you can change the colors. So I think this will be a lot better already to make it like this, you see. Um, so this is where you build up your character. So here you can also change his clothes, what kind of clothes this character has to wear. Um, one of the features in this software is here at the end where you can upload your own picture. Now I've done this and I don't really have a very good picture of myself, but you can load an image in here. So when I do myself, for example, Tim Friedau. I could take this picture and then what you can do, this takes a lot of work do, during this review, but you could put the eyes in here and you could put the ears in here and then what it's going to do at the end. So I, I'm not finishing this image right now because that's going to take a lot of work. But what you can do is when you say that you're dumb. So for example, you say, okay, this, this is a good image. Then what you can do is you say, I'm dumb and run. Now it will take this image, the head of this image, and it will put that into the character. I have no idea what will happen now. As you can see here, my face is in this image right now. So um, I haven't done this correctly as you saw in the previous video, but now you can see my face is in here. You see, I have the, the glasses on. You see my beard is in here. So what you could do is you could take existing pictures and then use that in animes to create your own characters. So let's say this is my character and I'm done. Then I can go to the end and I can call this character Tim, for example, and I can say generate a character and then I can press finish. Now this, now we're coming to the second part of the application and that's the scene builder. So here you can build all, all different kinds of scenes. And it works like this. At the left side, you get the preview, the, the scene view, what you're building in your timeline at the right side. So first at the left side, you can tell here after how many seconds the video needs to end. So let's say we're gonna end this video after six seconds. Then at the right side, we can add scenes that we wanna use. So when we press scene, uh, there's a new box in here where we can choose our character. But we start with the view. First, we want to tell where do we want to place this character. Now, as you can see in here, there are all different kinds of views that we can choose from all different environments 
uh, that we can use. So for example, we want to have this one in the gym. We can say, okay, I'm in the gym right now, camera one, and then I'm going to choose my character. So this is my character that I just created, Tim. So I can use this character and I want to have this character to be in the gym. So here you also need to select the same camera. And I have to say there's very good training about how to uh, work with this software. When you saw it, when I saw it for the first time, I needed the, the tutorials to know how to work with this. And I'm still a bit learning on how to do this. So this scene needs to start after zero seconds. And I think I've done it now. So when, when we click on this camera, we can see the scene. As you can see here, this is me. So here there's a button that you can click so it can rotate the personality. And right here, you can see, you can stop it whenever you want. And this is my first scene, for example. Now, what we can do is first, what you're going to do is you're going to build out all the scenes that you want to use. So my second scene here, I'm going to take my camera two, for example, in the gym. So I'm going to say camera two, and then I'm going to take the same character, my own character here, and I want to place this in gym camera two also. And now I can also view this camera uh, by pressing on this camera and then I can change this. As you can see, this is me again. So after you've done that, you're going to add the dialogue. Now you can, when you click the dialogue, you can do this in two ways. You can, you can put your own voice in here or what you can do is you can do text to speech. So for example, I can say, hi, my name is Tim. And I want to start this dialogue. First, I need to have my scene. So the first scene starts at zero seconds and the second scene starts at four seconds. So my first dialogue is my first scene. I want to start that also at zero seconds and I want to use an animation. So for example, so this is my first scene. I want to use an animation where uh, I'm going to bow, for example, and then I'm going to choose the voice. I want to use Alex and the name also, this is Tim. So this is my first scene and let, let's just play so that you can see how this works. Hi, my name is Tim. So that's my first scene and then it switches over to the second scene as you can see. So you could build out scenes and I need to add a new dialogue for the second scene that we just created here. And then I can just copy, I click this and then it will copy the same dialogue box. And I have to say, this has to start at four seconds. And then do you want to become a strong man, for example? And uh, this is the same guy. So now we have our two scenes. So when we play it now. Hi, my name is Tim. And then it switches. How do you want to become a strong man? So you need to play with this. So this was a bit slow. So probably my second scene needs to be after three seconds because this sentence is very short. So this is the text to speech part, but you can also uh, record your own voice within this script. So you could you could do a bunch of things. Um, when I delete this, you could also choose. So for example, this is my first scene. Uh, you could also put a second character in the same scene. So let me see if I do this correctly. So now I need to choose the gym camera two, and I think I need to, let's say the mill plumber to take this guy. And let me see if this is correctly somewhere in the scene. This is also gym camera two. So when we go to, no, I, I'm not doing this right, but um, I need to go to tutorial to to see this again but what you can do is you can also put two persons into one scene and uh, maybe i have to put this in zero seconds not sure no but you, you can put those in, in into one scene and then you can let them talk to each other or you could have those two characters speak to the persons who's looking at them at the at the monitor uh, at the video to say so. So when you're selling stuff, for example, if you want to create videos for a gym, you could say, hey, can I take your picture? You could sell these videos to make gym promotion videos, for example. And then you take a, 
a good picture of them and you make a character of those people and maybe they can also speak into a microphone or you can simply do the text to speech and then you could create videos in a gym like this um, as a promotion video for the gym and like i said there are many scenes um, when we see in here you see you got the hospital the gym the coffee shop the hospital car show uh, there there are many areas that you can look so let's take this one character let me take myself somewhere in the scene and then you also always need to take the same one so this car room let me see where is it um boom, boom, boom. i don't see it now cars room two let's take this also the cars room camera two let's see what this is you see now we're at another complete other area and other scene that we are so you could do this there are some extra options so you could also add sound to it sound effects so when you click on sound effects you can choose from the different tracks that are in here there are not much tracks in here um, and here you can play the track so if you have track one you can simply play it and it, it will play the sound uh, there's also music that you can add so simply click on music and you see there are also um, five music tracks in here so this, it's not much so you should play it you see so personally don't expect too much from the sound box and the music box you can always export a video like this and then um, later add your own music on top of it that would be my suggestion to do so and then at the end when you're done you can simply click on save and then you can save the product project to your computer and that's basically how this application works so you could create pretty cool scenes with this software uh, where you could say let, let these characters say anything you want uh, you could also like i said uh, showed here um where was it uh, when we do a dialogue here you can also do the animation you could choose to punch to mail kiss to sit clapping stand clapping hand raising blow a kiss kicking there are some um, things that you could let the character do idle and um, yeah that's basically it so when you save your project um, you can always use it later and modify the, the timeline of this specific uh, video that you're creating so let me go to the the pricing of this product so the front-end product of animes is 47 to 5, 57 dollars and the price will increase gradually throughout the launch um, but they have a coupon to bring the price back down to the original price so make sure you watch on my website to see the the, the coupon most of the times the coupon is also on the sales page but during launch time this is only going to cost you 47 dollars for the front end um, and you'll get what you just saw convert headshots into talking head characters with photo mapping technology what i just showed you uh, creates personalized 3d characters and brings actors to life with facial animation and dynamic motions uh, point click technology to create 3d videos at different camera angles well you just saw what i did then the first upsell is anime's pro it's the pro version which is 67 dollars one time and this is an upgrade where you can unlock additional scenes characters and more audios so you're going to get 15 extra premium soundtracks 15 extra background music 30 3d characters from different niches and 30 3d scenes from different niches and you got fit premium support so faster response time this is the first upgrade so probably if you're going to take an upgrade this could be a good one because there are a lot more characters uh, in this upgrade then we get upsell 2 which is anime's agency uh, which is $67 one time um, and you will get a done for you website highly valuable uh, you'll get the ability to give access to a team of multiple virtual assistants you get a ready-made email sales script. You get done-for-you proposals, PowerPoint and Word. You get done-for-you print-ready commercial graphics templates. Uh, you get done-for-you Facebook ads creative, pretty impressive. Done-for-you pimped to sell telemarketing scripts and done-for-you legal contracts. So you get a bunch of stuff um, for this upsell too for only $67. 
And then the third upsell is the Animes Templates Club. And this has two payments options. So you could do $37 a month or you could do a 97 uh, one time, which goes up to 127 yearly after the launch. So right now during launch time, you can get these templates, all these templates for $97 instead of 127 yearly after the launch. And this upgrade includes 50 high quality done for you templates. Uh, users like you can preview, download and import these beautiful fresh pre-done templates into animes and use them to get more unique eye popping videos. Um, the avatars, characters, animators, voice scripts are all done and ready for you to tweak and sweet um, and use for whatever local business you're targeting. So that's the, the third upsell of this product. So that's basically it. Uh, that's about animes. If you have any questions, make sure you ask them. More details uh, are below this video. Also some bonuses that you're going to get. So make sure you click the link below this video to check it out. If you have any questions, ask them in the comments below or directly on my website, timverdahl.com. There's a chat box in there. Uh, for now, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Click the button below the video to check out Animes, the sales page and the bonuses that you're going to get. And uh, thank you for watching and hope to see you in my next review video. Have an awesome day. Talk soon. Bye bye.